Okay, hi guys. Um, as you can see, I'm with my mama. Grandma. Yeah, hi everybody. I'm my grandmother. <laughs> with my mom. And um, as you can see, we're twinning. Twinsies. <laughs> yeah. And um, basically what we're here to talk about today is... Um, sorry, okay, what's what's up? up? What's up? So, um, what's up is like... It's like a life-changing phenomenon and um, I think one of the things that has sort of struck both of us is the way it has sort of changed social interaction and etiquette and um, so basically what we're here to do is just talk about WhatsApp and how annoying it Irritating. can be, <laughs> it can be. Um, so um, what were we going to say? Our pet peeves okay. about WhatsApp. So pet peeves about WhatsApp, um, I, okay go first. My first pet, pet peeve is don't include me on a group without telling me what the group is about and your intentions. I hate it when I see something like you've been added to this new group and I say what? What group? And I just exit immediately. It's really annoying. What group? That's one of my pet peeves. <laughs> it's already guessing emotion. Yes. <laughs> it's already guessing round up. You have been added to this group. I mean, for me, personally, mm. I don't mind being added to groups. I guess because most times, I don't really, I'm not really ever added to groups that I don't want to be in, or I didn't know that I was going to be in. I guess for you, the thing is, why add me if if I didn't know, right? Or why? Yes, that's, they, yes. I mean, I, you, you haven't discussed anything with me. I don't even know you. There was a group, I didn't even know the lady. And she, I, and she had alerted me on the group. And I said, please, who are you? How did you get so your number though? I wonder. I don't know. Maybe she got it on a, from a friend or something. My issue is that maybe I'm not in the mood to open WhatsApp, right? And I want to be on Twitter. But the thing is that the people, some of my friends, are probably online on Twitter as well. So if I'm tweeting and I'm not WhatsApping, it's like they know that I'm online. I have access to the internet. Why am I not responding? Do you get? Why am I not responding to their to their WhatsApp? But I mean, I feel that the prerogative should be, if I don't want to reply on WhatsApp, do I have to or no? Oh, that's not even a problem because now you can always, I mean, hide whether you can hide whether you're online or whatever. You can hide that on WhatsApp. They no, don't have to know thing. your status. No, 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 no. But you know, if I'm, if you don't know my status on WhatsApp, you don't yes. know I'm online, right? Yes. But you can see me tweeting or yeah. making a, or doing a post, or putting a post on Facebook. Yeah. You know that I'm online. Yeah. As in, I have internet. I might not be on WhatsApp. Yeah. So people might take it to mean that I am either being rude or just not ignoring their message. You don't get what I'm saying. I get what you're saying, but for me, that's not even an issue because you can, they, you might be busy doing something else online. For me, that's not really an issue. Uh, okay, okay. But the How issue about? is, for me, is they have common WhatsApp groups. Uh -huh, uh -huh, for instance, uh -huh. if I belong to like five WhatsApp groups, and somebody else belongs to the same five WhatsApp, WhatsApp yeah. groups I have. And the same person downloads the same video or the same message on the diff five different WhatsApp group. So I'm getting the same message on the same platform. I mean, I think that's very annoying. No, no, but for me, it's like, you know when, if you have like people that are on your, on the same, on the WhatsApp group, yes. group right? Say you have, okay, say you have maybe you and your sister, you have yes. like your private chat. Yes. You know, the group that you and Star are in. Yes. Right? Yes. So my own is that when you have like that WhatsApp group mm. and they're like sending messages there mm. and then you reply to that to the group but you don't reply to her own personal message. Mm. Isn't that a bit weird as well? It's a bit weird. But sometimes you might never necessarily be doing it on purpose. Maybe that one is more urgent or whatever. But you have to like to now navigate the dynamic of okay, before I reply on this WhatsApp group, I have to go reply all the personal messages of all the people that are in that WhatsApp group. And then sometimes when you're in different WhatsApp groups with different people, yes. So maybe it's the same people but different yeah. groups, right? Yeah. Or maybe one or two people added here and there. Yeah. Yeah. So you're replying on one group, but you're not replying on the other group. It's like, yeah. are you not giving preferential treatment to one group? It's just it's a just, mess. It's just complicated. <laughs> then I, the one I don't like is also you have a general WhatsApp group, mm -hmm. and two people are holding private conversations mm. on the platform on the yeah. group platform, uh -huh. and then it's a place of settling scores. You know who is fighting with who on the WhatsApp group? Mm -hmm. Maybe A is fighting with B. And then it's B's birthday on the group. Mm -hmm. And A just says, oh, happy birthday. Because A has to say happy birthday. 
then it's C's turn and then A now sends two pages of oh how I love you you're just the best happy birthday mwah, mwah, mwah. I mean it's just a place of settling personal who wants to know whether you're quarreling or whatever and what's that group but it's just not I mean I get what you're saying though. people have clicks on the whatsapp group you know that doesn't make any sense like just go take your click out of the group i mean a b I, and I c okay let me just tell you this one okay it's still the same thing i have a grouse and um, we have a common group mm -hmm. a doesn't really like b mm -hmm. so anytime b posts or drops anything on the whatsapp group a snobs b but anytime c Somebody posts else something can. else oh there's i mean there's feedback there's mm -hmm. interaction mm -hmm. But, but when it's B's turn, A is just silent. It's a snob. And the silent to me just shouts loud loud and clear that I don't really like you. We're on the same WhatsApp group. I'd rather you weren't here, but I'm stuck with you. Yeah. I just think it's not fair. Please, please, please. Is this an ego thing? Must you be the one that sends the longest chats? I don't understand how emails... Now get posted as chats. You have like four pages of stuff as a chat. And then 20 people now. I mean, look, I have a lot of contacts. So on a given day, I get like 20 different read more. I don't like that. This thing is going to be very long. Exactly. But just read till the end. I mean, <laughs> if I have to spend like, if I have to read all your chats, I'm going to spend like two hours in 24 hours reading it's when i read that the person was like if you don't want to go to hellfire or something like that then you should read that and was then, all the more reason why i did <laughs> the message. And, and the one that says forward this to somebody or else yeah yeah, yeah. or forward to 12 people that or, see else, it comes back back to you. or else why should i read all those your posts what makes them so special and they're not even original some of them you haven't even read the content i guess some that the person now says oh i'm sorry it's a mistake this mi have you ever got any of those ones no. that this is wrong or this doesn't represent the true oh yeah no sometimes some people post wrong things, information, wrong information and then someone asks to not counter like yes like the queen sorry, are died you sure that, um, and you know are you sure that um uh, they're not like going point by point how this might not be right and yeah so fake news fake, fake news. news yes fake mm. news i don't like it and then all those heavy videos it takes all my memory space i mean honestly i get quite a lot in a day and do you really expect me to to and most of the time the senders don't even read these things or watch them they just follow them they just follow they them for it as received are you, are you, exactly <laughs> as received. exactly or copied as as received I'm not yeah. like, and do you know guys, should though. i tell you this should, should i tell you a secret some of those things i don't read them and my sister caught me she sent me a joke and I just put an emo, what do you call them? Emoji. Emoji that, ah, 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 very funny. I, I, I didn't actually open it. Then she now saw me and said, oh, hello, sis. Did you see that funny thing? I said, oh, let me confess. I didn't actually open it. She said, but, you, but you put the smiling face. I said, yes, I'm so sorry. <laughs> you know, most of them, I just, I mean, I just sit in the evening and I just scrape all of them. Like random, all this scraping, like all your video clips. Photos. photos happy new month, happy new month. i just scrape good morning, them good morning <laughs> delete them but i now go to recently deleted and delete again <laughs> <laughs> for emphasis <laughs> it's all i'm so aggressive about it. i'm taking all your space you know <laughs> it's a lot i completely get it. i mean i had to actually block my no, no, what I had before that my the photos and videos just uh, download automatically into yes. my camera roll. Okay. So I have to like switch off the automatic thing so that it's only my WhatsApp it doesn't like clog my. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, please do that for me. But well, apart from that, apart from let's look at the plus side. There was a group that I'm telling you, I'm not exaggerating. In a day, on the average, I used to get 129 chats in a day. That's for, for one particular. The dons, the dons of WhatsApp. So I exited, they put me back on. I exited, they put me back in. It was like I had to actually sneak out of that group <laughs> while no one was watching because <laughs> they would have put me back on. <laughs> you sneak out of it. I don't time. know. I just look like, I mean, as if, you know, I, in my mind, as if, hey, there's nobody watching. <laughs> Let me just run. 
and I ran for my dear life. <laughs> <laughs> to me, I can never. I don't think I've ever leave a WhatsApp group. I feel it's kind of rude. Like it's kind of. Yeah, you said so. It's kind of like yo, you guys are just playing, or yo, you guys are beneath me, or well, uh, I don't know. I feel like that's kind of the message that it passes across. So I mean, I would never leave. I might mute it. I might never say anything on the group. I might never. But I wouldn't leave. I wouldn't leave. Oh, no, I had to leave. Except that I wasn't. Maybe if it was like a. I don't know, a group where I wasn't a part of the group anymore and then I'd say, okay, please remove me or whatever. But I don't think I'd ever I had to, I had to leave one. The apologies. I just, I have, I've left one or two. Yeah. I no mean, apologies. I'm it's left, fine. Yeah. There are a lot of advantages. I mean, like passing mm-hmm. information across. Actually chatting with, real chatting with, communicating with a friend. Connecting. Connecting. These things that you just drop are not connecting. They're, they're, they're not. Um, they're just random. They're just random information that you believe yeah. that I should watch or listen. For me, I, even, I think it's proud. It, it, it's, it's pride. Why do you think this is. Who tells you that I need to listen to this? Mm. Or I need to read this? And you know, as, at times it's as if it's competition on some groups. Somebody sends a message forward or whatever and then people haven't even read that people haven't responded to that and you just ignore that and you send your own as if i mean mine is more important mine is more interesting do you understand somebody drops something for the group to discuss mm-hmm. and they're just like it's like they're yes and they're telling each other that you know it's as if it's a competition that no 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 this must be rubbish read mine or read mine you know but i think it's it, it, I mean, WhatsApp is good as a platform. It, it like, you is. can video call, you can voice call. It's, it's a good way to connect. connect to people across boundaries and borders. People that you haven't seen in like yes, years. Yes. Classmates that you haven't spoken to. Yes. You know the classmate, ah, classmate groups. I mean, I've had the chance to talk to someone who I haven't seen in like six years. Mm. Um, so I think that's a good thing. But I guess just these like fine lines between... You know, and then I had to put up my red, the blue ticks, the red um, yes. delivered. Because... I felt like it was it was becoming like an invasion of privacy. Like, what if I've read your message and I don't want to reply? I think that's still like my prerogative. Mm. And I know that I'd, I would feel offended if I had asked the question and someone didn't reply. Mm. I just switched it off. I, I don't know if that's sort of like a, sort of like a cop out, but um, I don't know. I don't know. But I guess it's just like a new sort of etiquette and social interaction system that we need to like, navigate through. And I wonder what it'd be like like twenty years from now. Mm. or 50 years from now mm. maybe i don't know maybe it would be i don't know you don't just even in real in, in real time you don't just see somebody and dump books read this book read this article on a good day you don't give me like five articles yeah. to read you know <coughs> and you don't shove information like down my throat mm-hmm. and then you respond properly i mean i think it's just a nat- natural normal rules of etiquette but it's like we're ignoring those ones I guess because the, it's not really like a traditional form of com- traditional form of communication in the traditional form of mm. communication sense. Passing stale news, mm. um, <laughs> on refi- on corroborated news, mm. and then there's so much contradicting. Um, like I was at somewhere yesterday and said today, all these even, even all these um, tips, <laughs> especially with food. Someone said we should eat um, apple seeds, and apple seeds have cyanide. And today you post something that says this thing causes cancer, and, and tomorrow they say it's the, the top f- health food you should eat. I or mean, drink your water sitting down. Yes, I mean. Or drink your water lying down. I mean. Or drink water before you eat. So there you have it. Where? Uh, Coming to the light. Feel like anyway. So there you have it. We've uh, discussed the different WhatsApp. Don't worry, you don't have to lean on my head. Okay. <laughs> We've we've put it out there our WhatsApp pet peeves. Um, share yours. I mean, I'm sure everybody has like one WhatsApp story, one one group saga. <laughs> but they, let me never go there. So many different group issues there. Eh? Anyway, so um, share yours. What are your own um, WhatsApp peeves? What are the things that really annoy you and irritate you? Is it group chatting or is it the last scene, the ticks, or I don't know, Twitter, Facebook? new okay my mom says not new shall, but social new social etiquette a social interaction also i feel like it's new mm. i still feel like it's new that you need to generate something new yeah okay. i guess anyway so till next time bye from the twinsies with from the grandmom and granddaughter please all right bye, <laughs> bye.